Okay, so this is a quick video just to let people know about a new Cody build uh, by Steve. It's a really good build called Eminence, and I'm just going to show how you go about installing Eminence. So, what you need to do first is go to Facebook, and if you're not already a member of the group, if you type in M Eminence. Cody builds. There we go, and you'll see Eminence Cody builds. Uh, you'll have to request to join the group, and you can see this is the uh, the builds group. All the members in there, really, really good group. All the members and the admin are great, wanting to try and help in any way that they can do. So once you've joined that group, then you'll be given details of how to add a, a repo to Kodi. So if we go into Kodi and you'd go across to your system, your file manager, you're going to add source and as you can see here I've added the eminence source. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go into my settings to add-ons. First run you can see it's a fresh install as well and that's something that is really going to help a lot of people come across problems if they don't do a fresh install of Kodi first and then add the build. So it's a fresh install, nothing else on there other than what came with Kodi. And I'm going to install from zip file. I'm going to choose Eminence and there is the plugin for the Eminence zip. And we wait until it comes up there, the Eminence wizard add-on is enabled. So we're going to come back out of the add-ons, go to the programs, the, uh, my phone is just a little bit slow. I'm actually installing this on my phone which is a Samsung Galaxy Note 4 as well. So this it should work or be the same on the majority of Android devices. So I go to program add-ons and you can see the Eminence wizard. So click on there and there's the different builds on here it might take a moment for the the thumbnails to come up and we've got version 5 the latest one and we have the v5 alternative um, which is a separate download sometimes one can be busier than the other and then on the bottom left we have the v5 clean that's just let's just say it's um it's better for children there's there's no adult content in there so I'm going to install the V5, so I'll click on that and it's going to start downloading. Now depending on the speed of your internet and also how many people are downloading from this server at the time can affect how quickly the download um, will finish. So I'm just going to give that a moment to, to download. It seems to be going quite quickly. <coughs> And then we're going to be looking at, once we've installed it, what's available <coughs> on this build. Like I say, it's a not just a great build, but the group itself as well. Everybody's great in there. And there's a lot of members, so you're not really having to wait too long if you have a problem. There's always someone there um, ready to, to help out as soon as I can. So you can see that it's downloaded. Now it's just extracting all of the zip file and again you can see it's going pretty quickly through some people it might hang at around 30 40 percent maybe 70 percent again that can be down to the server also as well the device that you're using can also slow things down sometimes and android on any device can be buggy sometimes so it's worth going back having another go if it doesn't work out right first time so we can see that the uh, the extracting zip has just about finished and 99% nearly there. So it now says that the download is complete. <coughs> Have a nice day. Thank you. Now you don't want to press OK here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to press my home button to take me completely out of, an uh, out, out of Android, out of Kodi. So I'll click the home button which has brought me here. And then I am going to go to my settings. 
well, you would go through your settings and your apps. I'm actually just going to do it a bit quicker. I'm going to select Cody and I'm actually going to drag it up to my app info. You can go through your settings to your app info, but you want to click here on force stop. So this is going to force Cody to completely stop. And just to make sure that it's stopped, if you press, I'll press my menu button, we can see everything's still on there. So I will press the X and delete all previous apps that were running, possibly running in the background. So now when I click on Cody, it should now hopefully come up with the new skin. If it doesn't, you can see here now at the Eminence build, if it doesn't come up with the new skin and it just comes up with all the add-ons, just reinstall the V5 again. And when it says OK to close down, again, just exit straight out. Or if you're on a such as a, a Raspberry Pi, you would just pull the power out to completely close the system and then boot back up again. So you can see now that it's installed. We've got all the add-ons up in the top left hand corner updating and if I just quickly scroll through you'll see we've got the man cave we've got the kids section and we've got the movie section scroll back across we've got the TV section uh, you've got IPTV lists in there a lot of live TV as well sports you've got the sports section just there as well so it's quite easy to find all all the add-ons that you want really all the places we've got her place um, which if you've got Man Cave, you've got to have her place as well. I think it's great. TV shows, then we've got the music section, program section. Selected is, again, it's just selection of what the build, Builder ST has um, put in there. All of this is customizable if you wish to um, take things out, put new things in. Everybody has their own preferences to add-ons as well, but I think it's a great build to not only start off with, but also to just have on your devices all the time. So I will exit out of there, close down, and that's how to install the Eminence build. Thank you for watching. Any questions, post below. Be happy to help. And don't forget to go to the group on Facebook, which is Eminence Cody Builds. Thank you, and see you on the next video.